All right, so when the cooker is in the slide out position, your water pan is going to sit inside of this frame that slides out. There are hooks on the back that allow it to hold itself on that rack slide and keep the water pan from falling when it's in that position. The heat diverter that's blocking the hole, I'm going to pull this out so you can see that. So you can see the heat diverter is blocking the hole right now. There's no hole here, keeping your cooker of reverse flow. So if I open the firebox door, there's no heat diverter down on these rails because it's in this position. So if I want to use the unit in a drop-in style, I'm going to pull this heat diverter out and I'm going to drop it down onto that set of rails, allowing this hole to open up for my water pan to sit inside of. So the difference between a drop-in and a slide-out would be the drop-in cooker is going to allow you to have that extra rack slide so you have some more space for cooking. Where if you want to use it a little easier for refilling the water pan, you can put that back in the slide-out position, which I can show you how to do again. Making refueling the water inside the water pan easier to do because you can pull it out. That's the difference between the slide in and the drop out.